Hello, it's Estrella with the reading for the collective. Take what resonates and throw out the rest. This is a pre-read that I'm actually sharing with you because it's very intense and I think it's a continuation of the two previous readings that I did. Um, just a very, uh, a, there was a build up to a volatile situation. I think something went down very dramatic and brought things to a head. And now this is a, a karmic feminine energy uh, that's coming through here. And so I'm just going to bring you up to speed. So we've got someone who is acting like they lost their chance. Someone lost their chance, but they're acting like it's all fine. And there's a lot of talking going on here. Someone's being very, very on the bottom of the step. We've got extroverted saying a lot. So someone is talking a lot here. Oh, or, or they did in the past. It's like it's coming up to a head. They've been bullying someone. And, but that, they've been doing it quietly. But, um, and with this, it looks like something like someone's talking about someone's pictures. Or something like that. Someone has been just using their words. But, uh, and it's something to do with social media or internet or emails talking about someone's pictures but someone's acting frivolous and and they are talking a lot now or this was in the past and now this is happening between a karmic feminine and a divine masculine they're like alone or someone's alone in the house here and whatever they did it, it was very unorthodox and got full reversed here so very foolish um it was like a party atmosphere this person is being very false. It, it could be like they're trying to save face. Uh, it's like they're defending themselves, but just, this is like something about someone lost their chance, dusted off, talking shit. So it's like someone's being very talkative right now. They could be trying to bash a divine feminine, or they did in the past, but it's like somehow whatever it was is or was very unorthodox and it's all coming to a head what they've tried to do to you but it's like they're making their their case worse um if they're trying to cover it up by talking this is very extroverted we've got ace of swords here this is communication and then we've also got a page of swords that's sticking out here so this has to do with like spying and talking like a lot of um I'm also gonna say like verbal abuse, but acting like everything is fine. So this is either this is all coming to the surface here with this divine masculine, um, what they did in the past, or they're doing it now. And it's almost like they're trying to cover up doing exactly what they're doing now. So it's like they're talking shit about having talked shit about you, if that makes sense. It's like a abuse, uh, verbal abuse, and some someone was doing something in silence but you have been moving in silence because of this cyberbullying and then the challenge for this person is that it's really strange your light irritates their demons giving money something about like uh, it's I'm trying to unpack this whatever it was it's a surprise and then there's a message with the main mail that's attached. So something could have come out, some sort of evidence or something about what they did and it was a surprise. Someone could have even paid because they, they hate you so much to try to make leave you out in the cold and to, it was all very ego based or to make you weak somehow to stop your wish fulfillment, to, to keep you stuck. But, but that's the challenge for this person is like what they did, but what they did is now happening to them here. And they feel like you are though, however, they feel like they're very jealous in their subconscious, like you're moving on. You're working independently, but you're moving in silence. You're moving in silence, so they, they, don't, they don't know exactly what it is, but you're moving towards a jackpot. And you've been faith you've been faithfully working towards that and also towards your light and keeping balance. 
They're moving, you're moving very quickly. This is all in their subconscious. They know they're just picking it up about you, that your finances are improving, that in spite of whatever they did here, um, they're picking up the energy with this distant horizons and pathway that you're moving forward in spite of how hard they worked to try to destroy you, really. But it's that's what I, I what I, the only thing I'm not getting from this is if they are getting caught. Like if this is evidence, okay, let me take that back. It's all the evidence, at least with this masculine energy, it's very clear. And then with this um, main male message and this money, it's like something did come out. It's a, they, the, your light, there's something else here to it though, your light irritates their demons they can't stand and i think that's what's going on with this communication something about money and trying to bring you down and there's some harsh words very extroverted words that are going on it was like a continuation it's like whatever drama happened previously this is a continuation between this masculine and this karmic and things are all coming to the surface with some evidence. And it's like they're continuing to try to drag you. But it's like the evidence of what they've done is... They won't... It's like they're being relentless about what should or shouldn't happen to you. And that you aren't, you aren't anyone special or something like that. It's very... Um, it's like looking at your pictures as well is here. So what I can't tell is if this is discussing what they've done in the past. I, I think that it is, but they're like um, defending themselves, but making themselves, it's foolish with this fool in the reverse. They're, they're being false and acting like it's nothing and they're fine and everything's good, like real joyful being very cruel and very talkative and looking at you and like cyber bullying you they could be doing this with someone else in the presence of this masculine something like that so take what resonates it's like it's layered it's two things it's what they've done in the past coming to the surface and then doing it more now um, because they also know though that whatever they did whether it was just trying to ruin your reputation or whatever verbal things they were doing or tricks and games it's all coming out there's a surprise it has to do with a message but i think that it can't it's come out to more than just this masculine because of what i'm seeing here which i'll get to something i think this i think uh if you look at my previous um post about this drama that played out and, and it was just very clear who this person committed to. And we have here in the recent past, Queen of Pentacles reverse. So really materialistic, superficial, mean. It's like courthouse. It's like the universe create is creating judgment or justice. But also this could be someone wanting to go to the courthouse for this could be paperwork because of just how bad it got. This person, we've got Knight of Cups, fickle, moody, manipulative, untruthful, um, hustling. Just this whole thing was just after money. All they care about is money. We got money that came out. This has to do with someone got into some sort of commitment with your person based all on money. It was like a, hus a hustle. The whole thing was a hustle and trying to take you down in the process. Just cruel. And then, but this person is thinking... All of these came out here. We've got this is what they're thinking. Where you're heading? That's you, Queen of Wands. Like you're you're going to prosper anyway, um, and then this person's going to have to sit back and watch it. It's going to be a nightmare for them. They they are not going to be able to stop it. It's going to knock them out. That's how they feel because someone is going to is going to choose you, and everybody and everybody loves you, and it's time for a change because the 
the universe says so and there's going to be some sort of like communication and some some kind of a deal is coming towards you or work or someone is coming towards you this wealthy man energy this could be also a female but just for the kipper's sake it's called wealthy man we've got merchant here as well so it looks like something that this person was trying to block is all going to come to fruition and there's some sort of discussion or quick decision being made in regards to you because everybody loves you it's time for a change based on whatever this per foolish thing that this person did and now that everyone's aware of exactly who this person is and what they were after that there was no love involved here and how they were trying to destroy you um they were trying to stop your wishes and there was some message that came here to the light and somehow there's a shift someone it's like someone's advocating for you here but even if they didn't it's like in their subconscious they know you you have you've you you have figured out what to do in spite of this person and they know that in their subconscious they're not even realizing consciously that you you, you it would be great for more support but you don't even need that um because you figured something out and in the near future we've got a high priestess with this protection around you um lovers it looks like some kind of uh, contract either in love or business coming towards you um in spite of whatever the scarcity tactics were and uh it looks like someone's coming to help you or you're going to get receive some help um you've been you've been running from this bad energy as this queen of cups you've figured it out in spite of them and you're a high priestess so you've been operating in secret here moving in silence figuring it out on your own so there's going to be some evidence that whatever this person did one one is they're exposed in a big way to this masculine but also towards the community and how do i know that because one is they're feeling really uninspired, like they don't know what move to make here. It's like this is an end here with this Ace of Wands. Um, Ace of Wands. And it's like, a, it's like a nightmare for them. They're having a lot of anxiety and people are placing boundaries with them. And it's like they were trying to be a soldier of love, like try to block love for frivolous reasons. And it's like that's how they're being seen. They're being seen as played out. What they've been doing, people are rejecting them. I've got high honor in reverse where they're losing their position or status or clout because of what they tried to do to you. And so basically this grudge holder is reflecting. That's all they could do. How do they appear in the environment? They come across as a bully. This five of swords who is forced forced gaiety pretending that everything is fine but they're really chaotic and disorganized person that are overwhelmed that are dropping the ball in every in every way they're coming across as low iq basically meaning not smart whatever they did with this foolish because we have the full reversed here um and being left alone people don't want to have anything to do with them there's some sort of like surprise about them that's come out they're coming across as a very forceful person like a narcissist who forces their way like a bully and um that people have everyone wants to start over based on whatever relationships they've created with this person it's it's really bad whatever they've done here it looks like especially with this giving money it's like either trying to stop you from getting money because they they are jealous of your light but that's come out that's what's come out they're afraid that someone's gonna walk away or that everybody's walking away to find more meaning and that something about like their networks could be walking away um because we also have moving spiritual hater is going to be lonely because someone's moving but i think this isn't just a masculine energy i think it's more more than that that people are going to be because they're a spiritual hater but they're trying to cover it up here and act like everything's fine but they're just looking like very foolish 
they feel like they're going to be in this nightmare, the nightmare that they tried to create from you, whatever energies they were sending towards you is coming back. And they're going to be, they're going to be rejected because of this message, whatever it is that's come out. Or that also that people are going to see it because they care so much about how things appear. That's why they were trying to damage your reputation. They're going to be stuck like this in this nightmare that they created. And something about, like, again, messages came out again. We have messages, mess, message, message. Perhaps that some love is coming towards you or a message about love. Something like that. This could be like a something that's seen publicly somehow or a message, an email that gets out, something. This is again about, we've got message of concern, message. So a couple things is like social media, but also emails or text messages or something that's exposed that they did, but also how they're going to appear matters to them. And it seems that's what they're worried about. That's the concern um, or hope, hopes and fears position. Outcome, we have them left out in the cold here with the five of pentacles exactly what they wanted for you trying to block your money and your love and trying to be this like love soldier trying to uh determine who can do what um and we've got to because there's a two of cups a soulmate connection here that's coming towards you they've been there right now with this talking we've got tower in the reverse so they're trying to cover it up trying to avoid stop a tower and act like they're trying to act like everything is fine but everybody can see this is a really bad mix really bad mix something that they've been doing over and over and over again trying to block block someone's um, opportunities and have them be rejected so they're trying to use their their words and act like everything's fine but it's all falling apart here and whatever this soulmate connection is that they've been trying to block, whether this is your person from the past or someone coming in the future, whether it's love, business, uh, career, or work, uh, or friendships, whatever it is that they were trying to block, it's coming to you anyway. And that because they're so focused on whether or not you are happy, just the fact that you're happy is going to leave them in a dark night of the soul because this person is overly focused on you in a really twisted way. They're going to see you being being happy and joyful and they're going to be watching you obsessively um and for a lot of you this is a proposal with a divine connection that's coming to you with this two of cups and for them anything that works out for you um they're going to be looking at it like they want what you have from a superficial perspective though any any work that you've been doing or anything that comes through based on hard work that you've been doing in silence when they look at it, it's going to be at what you have or how it looks and um, expecting for, you know, that's how they're expecting for things to unfold for you is they're expecting for people to see you in a certain way um, and for things just to continue to unfold in this really beautiful way. And that's what leaves them in that in that five of coins. So right now they're being haunted by everything that they've said and done, said and done to try to hurt you right now. That's what's happening right now. And, um, your innocence, if there was a child involved as well, your, your innocence is coming out, how much of a sweetheart you are. And they're really also trying to act like a victim here as well. So, um, I hope that helps. I just thought it was pretty powerful read, so I thought I would share it with you. All right, bye.